Hi everybody and welcome along. Today we're going to take another look at the Palladium Cinema in Stowmarket. As more information has come to light, we thought the time has come to pop together a little update. So here we go. In the early part of the 20th century, Mr Thomas Fletcher was running a cinema in the Corn Hall or the Corn Exchange in Stowmarket, later in 1987 to be the site of Movieland Cinema and we're going to do a short video on that at another time. After J.B. Sulling's term running the Palladium Cinema, it was taken over by Messrs. Catamole and Joyce. Joyce was a schoolmaster who was also parish church organist and choirmaster. Edith Gladwell played the piano for most of the silent years and for epics there was a violin accompaniment in addition. Children paid a penny to threepence to sit on the wooden benches at the front. Adults paid up to sixpence for the plush seats at the back. One of the earliest projectionists was Frederick Spaulding, who started by himself at age 16 in 1916 and carried on until 1935, apart from one short break to work at a chemical works. For six or seven years he had to hand crank the single projector, but Mr Fletcher, then the palladium cashier, gave him a hand when the money had been taken and counted. Frederick Leakes was Mr Spaulding's part-time assistant, collecting too their fish and chips which were kept warm on top of the projector lamp house. And how many times have we heard that? When talkies came in 1931 with the sound on disc, it was difficult keeping the disc and projector in sync. Mouths moving and saying nothing was a constant cause of delight to 350 children in the Palladium on a Saturday afternoon. One of those kids in this photograph of the demolition, on the far right of the photo is Mr Roger Beale, who along with other boys bust in from Backton every Saturday. He says, Sometimes I couldn't hear the words for the screaming of the audience as hundreds of shrill voices greeted every event on screen. The one-time boy projectionist, Frederick Leakes, was by the time the cinema was demolished, Sergeant Leakes at Stowmarket Police Station. And that's about it for this short little update on the Palladium Cinema in Stowmarket. Keep watching more videos coming your way all the time on cinemas lost forever. In the meantime, be good to each other and I'll see you soon. Ta-da!